a top name has revealed an interesting story about texting Paul Heyman after WWE cancelled a big match that was promised to them. Ronda Rousey and Becky Lynch were fierce rivals back in the day. Unfortunately, the duo never had a singles match on WWE TV. Rousey is currently promoting her new book, Our Fight, a memoir, in which she opened up in detail about her frustration with not getting her promised match with Lynch. As per Rhonda's book, WWE had promised her a match with the man but later cancelled the same. She was furious over the development and texted Paul Heyman, demanding that she put Charlotte Flair over on WWE SmackDown. She then had a chat with Triple H and was later paired with her real-life best friend Shayna Baszler on WWE TV. Ronda Rousey was close to being managed by Paul Heyman. After Ronda Rousey's signing in 2018, many fans were expecting her to align with Paul Heyman on WWE TV. It never happened, though. While speaking with Rick Rubin on the Tetragrammaton podcast, Heyman opened up about having limited options in his WWE agreement, which contained a list of potential superstars he could manage. They don't measure up to where you're used to seeing my character bring someone down to the ring, which is either the main event of WrestleMania or close to it. One of the few names on this list was Roman Reigns. Another was Brock Lesnar, obviously. Another was Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey was having a baby. Brock Lesnar wasn't coming back with Saudi being down. That kinda left Roman Reigns in there. Rousey lost to Shayna Baszler in an MMA rules match at SummerSlam 2023. She left WWE immediately after. She has been taking shots left and right at the promotion lately and it seems highly unlikely that she will ever make a return. Title. The Unforeseen Encounter. Paul Heyman's text from a furious star. Paul Heyman, the mastermind behind some of the most exhilarating storylines in WWE history, sat in his office, contemplating the events of the past few hours. He had just received a text message from a Hollywood megastar, one he never expected to hear from in this context. The message came after WWE had to cancel a promised match due to unforeseen circumstances leaving both Heyman and the star disappointed and frustrated. As Heyman stared at his phone screen, the name, Dwayne Johnson, flashed boldly across it. His mind raced as he recalled the promise he had made to The Rock weeks ago, a promise that now lay shattered due to circumstances beyond his control. Heyman's mind rewound to the moment when he and The Rock had struck a deal over drinks at a luxurious Los Angeles hotel. It was a rare occasion where the lines between WWE and Hollywood blurred, and Heyman relished the opportunity to collaborate with such a legendary figure. The plan was grandiose yet simple. A one-night-only return to the squared circle for The Rock, where he would face off against one of WWE's rising stars in a match that would electrify fans worldwide. Heyman had worked tirelessly to set the stage for this moment, securing the venue, promoting the event, and ensuring everything was in place for The Rock's triumphant return. But fate had other plans. A sudden injury to The Rock's co-star in an upcoming blockbuster film forced him to fly out of the country on short notice, leaving Heyman scrambling to salvage the situation. Despite his best efforts, there was no way to reschedule the match or find a suitable replacement in such a short time frame. As Heyman pondered his next move, his phone buzzed with a new message from The Rock. With a mixture of trepidation and curiosity, Heyman opened the text. Paul, I understand the situation, and I'm disappointed we couldn't make it happen. But you and I both know that in this business, plans change. Let's not dwell on what could have been. Instead, let's look forward to what's next. I'll be back in the ring someday, and when that time comes, you'll be the first person I call. Until then, keep doing what you do best, entertaining the masses and making magic happen. You're a true visionary, my friend. Stay in touch, DJ. Heyman couldn't help but smile at The Rock's words. Despite the setback, there was a sense of camaraderie and mutual respect that transcended the world of professional wrestling and Hollywood glitz. It was a reminder that in the unpredictable world of show business, the bonds forged between colleagues often proved to be the most enduring. 
feeling a renewed sense of purpose. Heyman began brainstorming new ideas and storylines, each more audacious than the last. He was determined to turn this setback into an opportunity to captivate audiences in ways they never thought possible. In the days that followed, Heyman threw himself into his work with a newfound zeal. He collaborated with WWE's creative team to craft compelling narratives, scouted talent from around the globe, and explored innovative ways to engage with fans both inside and outside the arena. And then, just when it seemed like all hope was lost, an unexpected opportunity presented itself. A rival promotion, sensing weakness in WWE's ranks, issued a challenge. A winner takes all showdown on the grandest stage of them all. It was a bold move, one that sent shockwaves through the world of professional wrestling. Heyman saw it as a chance to prove once and for all that WWE was still the undisputed king of sports entertainment. With the backing of WWE's top brass, Heyman accepted the challenge, vowing to deliver a spectacle that would leave fans on the edge of their seats. As the countdown to the showdown began, Heyman spared no expense in promoting the event. From flashy commercials to star-studded press conferences, he pulled out all the stops to ensure that the world would be watching when the two titans clashed. Finally, the day of reckoning arrived. The stadium was packed to the rafters with eager fans, their anticipation palpable in the air. The atmosphere crackled with electricity as the competitors made their way to the ring, each determined to emerge victorious. What followed was a spectacle unlike anything the world had ever seen. From jaw-dropping acrobatics to bone-crunching slams, the action was non-stop from start to finish. The crowd roared with every near fall, every daring maneuver, every twist and turn in the unfolding drama. And in the end, it was WWE who emerged triumphant, cementing their status as the preeminent force in professional wrestling. As Heyman basked in the glow of victory, he couldn't help but reflect on the journey that had brought him to this moment. From the disappointment of a cancelled match to the exhilaration of a hard-fought victory, it had been a roller coaster ride of emotions. But through it all, one thing remained constant. His unwavering passion for the world of sports entertainment. And as long as he had that, he knew that there would always be new heights to reach, new challenges to overcome, and new stories waiting to be told. With a smile on his face and a fire in his heart, Paul Heyman looked to the future, ready to continue making magic happen in the world of professional wrestling. And who knows?